Why is this not coming off? You may not remove the outfit. You gotta be kidding me. Honey, those low-rise jeans are not it. Pull them up. Thanks, Mom. What in the mean girls are you wearing? My soulmate decided what time period I dressed from, and he picked... Early 2000s. <laughs> Did the Hello Kitty give it away? Girl, we all picked the food option. What is wrong with you? Well, how long is this going to go on for? Pretty sure it's until we kiss our soulmates. What? No, that could take forever. And all my stuff are turning into things from the 2000s. I have a flip phone now. Yikes. Sucks to be you. Hey, Mean Girls called. They want their wardrobe back. <laughs> for the next outfit, please be present time. The year 3000. Oh, no. For the next outfit, please be present time. The year 3000. Oh, no. What am I wearing? I can't go to school like this. Ugh. You may not remove the outfit. <laughs> What's up, cyborg? <laughs> you know what? Joke is on you guys, because in the year 3000, everyone is going to be dressed like this. So I'm actually ahead of the fashion trends. Right. Well, until then, guess we get to enjoy your little fashion show. Can't wait to see what outfit her soulmate picks next. <laughs> Why do you look so happy? Because I learned I can take off these glasses just as long as I keep them on my head. I think you lost a lip gem, and you kind of looked better with the glasses on. You gotta help me find my soulmate because I am not going to be able to stop dressing in these ridiculous outfits until I kiss him. Sorry, girl. I mean, he's out there somewhere. You'll find him eventually. <sighs> what the? Please, just for the next outfit, present time, okay? Please, just for the next outfit, present time, okay? The 60s. 60s? Mom? Honey, I don't know why you're mad. You look so cute. Mom, this isn't cute. It's embarrassing. Please, don't make me go to school. You have a math test today. You're going. No way. <laughs> she looks like she's straight out of Teen Beach Movie. <laughs> Hey, why haven't you been responding to my messages? You see, I wasn't able to because my phone turned into this today. Is that a radio? Sorry, girl. I gotta find my soulmate. Hey. What? I was talking around and I think I know somebody who knows your soulmate. Who? Shh, there's no talking during the test. I'll tell you tomorrow. Another day, another outfit. The 90s would be fun. Let's try for that. The 80s. The 90s would be fun. Let's try for that. The 80s. I'm afraid to look. Oh my gosh, this might be the worst one yet. Am I wearing roller skates? Oh man. Mom. <laughs> Can we stop with the photos for like one second, please? Because this is serious. I can't go to school like this. It's against dress code. Can't you change into something else? Trust me, I have tried. You may not remove outfit. You'll be fine, honey. Don't worry. Okay, well, thanks for the help. Oh, hey. Sorry. Watch it. Oh, wow. Please tell me you have information about my soulmate. I do. So recently, there's this guy who's been tweeting stuff like, have you seen this girl wearing a 3000s outfit or a 60s outfit? Those are the outfits that I've been wearing. Yeah, thank you, Captain Obvious. I know. Problem is, yesterday he deleted his account. How am I even supposed to find him? Well, I'll keep doing some more digging. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. Later, loser. Medieval times. Oh, and just when I thought it couldn't get any worse, it did. Mom. Oh, honey, smile. Okay, Mom, please tell me you were not posting these photos on your Facebook. Well, I was. Mom. But I stopped because this boy was commenting weird things and he wanted to know where you lived, so I blocked him. Wait, Mom, that could have been my soulmate. Oh, maybe. Please just unblock him and message him, okay? All right. Okay, so I did some more digging, and I found out your soulmate's name. Oh, thank goodness, because I am so done dressing like this. Oh, I gotta take this call. No, no, just tell me his name right now, because... I'll be right back. Hello? Delaney! Wow, so we got a princess at her school now. <laughs> Could I have your crown? No, I want it. Actually, guys, the crown really won't come off my head. Yeah, right. Get her. Guys, come on. Oh, honey, smile. Okay, Mom, please tell me you were not posting these photos on your Facebook. Well, I was. Mom! But I stopped because this boy was commenting weird things and he wanted to know where you lived, so I blocked him. Wait, Mom, that could have been my soulmate. Oh, maybe. Please just unblock him and message him, okay? All right. Okay, so I did some more digging and I found out your soulmate's name. Oh, thank goodness, because I am so done dressing like this. 
Oh, I gotta take this call. No, no, just tell me his name right now because... I'll be right back. Hello? Delaney! Wow, so we got a princess at her school now. <laughs> Could I have your crown? No, I want it. Actually, guys, the crown really won't come off my head. Yeah, right. Get her. Guys, come on. Hurry up and change me out of this outfit right now. I got six students after this crown. Honey, I found your soulmate. Oh, honey, smile. Okay, Mom, please tell me you were not posting these photos on your Facebook. Well, I was. Mom! But I stopped because this boy was commenting weird things and he wanted to know where you lived, so I blocked him. Wait, Mom, that could have been my soulmate. Oh, maybe. Please just unblock him and message him, okay? All right. Okay, so I did some more digging and I found out your soulmate's name. Oh, thank goodness, because I am so done dressing like this. Oh, I gotta take this call. No, no, just tell me his name right now because... I'll be right back. Hello? Delaney! Wow, so we got a princess at our school now. <laughs> Could I have your crown? No, I want it. Actually, guys, the crown really won't come off my head. Yeah, right. Get her. Guys, come on. Hurry up and change me out of this outfit right now. I got six students after this crown. Honey, I found your soulmate. Caveman era. Please tell me I'm wearing clothes. Well, you are, but look. Oh, what the? I can't believe this. Um, honey? No, Mom, you told me you knew my soulmate's name, so go ahead and tell me, because once I find out, he's gonna regret giving me this. What is that sound? Sweetheart, stay still. Please don't tell me it's what I think it is. Try to stay calm. Mom, just tell me everything I need to know about my soulmate. Okay, his name is Jason, and he's gonna meet me after class. Got it. Honey, wait, that dress is so short, you could get dress coded. You know, if they haven't dress coded me by now, I think I'm good. Oh my gosh, is that a snake? Yeah, that's right. Say hello to my little friend. Ugh, please, stay back. I'm sorry for being mean. Oh, whoops. Hey, my apologies. I didn't mean to... Ancient Rome. What did you do to me? What am I wearing? Here, take a look. You know what? I'm not mad at this. <laughs> See? I knew you'd like it. Okay, you've had your fun using me as your model. Now, where's my kiss? <laughs> Come here. You may now dress freely. Yes, finally. Would you like to pick what era your soulmate dresses from now? What? Hey, now wait just a minute. Guys, she's over here, and she's got a new outfit. What are you supposed to be, Medusa? <laughs> <laughs> you see, you see what I've had to put up with? So if I'm gonna get made fun of, so are you. Wait. Seriously, you had to pick the 70s. I mean, listen, you're pulling it off really well. Oh my gosh, girl, is this hottie with an accent your soulmate? Yes. Yes, he is. Do 90s, honey. Ooh, yes. Really, babe, you're giving me the baggiest pants ever? Sorry, babe, but you know, I gotta have a little revenge. Yes, I deserve it. Excuse me? I saw this flower and I thought of your face. Do you think I have Riz? Honestly, you need to work on it. Why did I just get money? Cuz, sweetheart, every time someone has a crush on you, you get money. We're gonna be witch. Wanna go prom dress shopping? I can't. I'm broke. You have no new crushes? No. Oh my gosh, what did I tell you? You're so pretty, but you don't talk to anyone. That is not true. I talk to Tommy. Tommy is a little creep who likes to stalk you. He doesn't count. You need to talk to other boys. Look, it's not my fault that I have social anxiety. Girl, just let me teach you how to flirt. I can flirt, okay. Here comes a guy. Hi, um, I like your face. Huh? You know that I have a girlfriend, right? Right. <laughs> and you lost more money, didn't you? Yeah. You're coming with me. Fine. This is perfect for prom. I'm telling you I'll buy it for you. And I'm telling you I can't. It's way too short. My parents would kill me. What's going on? What's up with your crushes? I don't know, it just- Hey. What the freak, Tommy? What are you doing in the girls' dressing room? Listen, I posted something that's gonna make you rich. Tommy, what did you post? It's nothing bad, it's just- You tell me what you posted, right? Oh my gosh, you need to see this. Don't get mad. You need to see this. Don't get mad. You recorded me without me knowing? Look, I was just trying to get you some more money. Do you know what's gonna happen when my parents see this video? Are they gonna get mad you're wearing that dress? Come on, you're 18. And that video's viral, so you're gonna be rich. Tommy? Yeah? Delete it. Uh, I kind of got logged out of my TikTok account. You what? <laughs> Her video is getting so many views. 
You little creep, Tommy. Ow. That's for following us. <clears throat> oh, jeez. And that's for recording me without permission. I was just trying to help. Casey, where are my other clothes? I don't know. They were right here. Hey, looking for these? Hey! See ya. How much money you got now? Two thousand. Wow, I guess your video's really going viral. Girl, calm down. Well, you know, I don't like attention like this. Can you please just buy me this dress and I just want to go home? I actually have to go. What? You'll be fine. You're rich now. Casey, please, you can't just leave me like this. Sorry. Casey! Bye. You're going to wear the dress out? It's going to be $122. Where are you going? To the bus. And I would appreciate it if you would stop following me. You're cute. Hey, are you okay? No, I'm not okay. Casey left me with no way home, and this creepy guy was following me, so I couldn't get the bus home, and- I deleted the video. You did? Yeah, it's doing more harm than good. Uh, your friend just posted something. What's happening? Uh, your friend Casey just posted something. This rich girl literally gets mad at me for not buying her a dress. Just buy me this dress? I don't have enough money. Casey! She edited this. I just can't believe that she would do this to me. She definitely got jealous of you getting all these crushes, but you know what? Come on. I'll go with you to go confront her. Look, it's the whiny rich girl. Boo! Get out of here! Hey! The video was faked, and we're gonna prove it. Come on. Casey. What is wrong with you? I thought that we were friends. Oh, the video? I was just showing people the real you, that's all. It's not real if you edited it. Yeah! Did you not ask me to buy your dress? You offered to pay for me for that dress. That was before you had $2,000, and then you still asked me to buy it. Well, I'm sorry I wasn't thinking clearly, because I was in the middle of having a panic attack. Well, boo-hoo for you. Just admit you edited the video. Okay, I edited the video. Does that make you feel happy? No one's gonna find out anyways. We wouldn't be so sure about that. Say hello to my live stream with over a million viewers. You've been streaming this? Yep, and you heard the truth here, guys, so pass it on. Whoa. My crushes are disappearing. <laughs> FYI, a lot of people on the live stream were shipping us together. <laughs> well, you kind of stuck up for me when my best friend didn't, so... Are you giving me a chance? If you promise no more stalking. Deal! Oh my gosh, I've been dreaming of this my whole life. I mean, uh, I'm cool. I'm cool. Darling, are you ready for scare school? Yeah, but I'm kind of sad Halloween break is over. Well, have you gotten your scary soulmate yet? I haven't yet, but I'm sure it'll say vampire. Any species will be fine, as long as it doesn't say... Monster Hunter. Don't worry, dear. I'm sure you will get a spooktacular soulmate. Of course. Um, I better get to class. Class, for an icebreaker, why don't we all tell each other our scary soulmates? Batalina, we'll start with you. Well, my scary soulmate is... Red alert. Red alert. Monster Hunter has been detected on property. <gasps> what? Everyone, be quiet. Get to the safe room. Batalina, hurry. We have to get to the safe room. Julia, I don't know what's wrong. There must be garlic around here somewhere. But they're about to close the doors. Just go. Save yourself. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I see you fell right for my garlic trap. Finally, I've caught my first vampire. You're coming with me. You're coming with me. What the? Oh, hell no. I'm not dealing with this. Get away from me. Welcome back from school. Here, eat some zombie fingers. I'm not really hungry. Mom says my things are going to come in before yours. That's really great, Luna. Listen, I have to tell you something, but you have to promise not to tell Mom and Dad. Is it about your soulmate? Yes, and I'm only telling you this because I can't stand keeping this secret anymore. <gasps> is your soulmate a werewolf? No, worse than that. Uh, is he a ghost or something? Worse. Wait, is your soulmate a human? Yeah. Is your soulmate a monster hunter? Shush, they're gonna hear you. Monster hunters want to experiment on us. I know, okay? I almost got captured by one today. Wait, what? Look, it's a long story, but... No way I'm answering that. Luna! Bethelina, go see who's at the door. Of course. Hey, remember me? I got a surprise for you. <laughs> you caught a beautiful vampire, son. Thanks, it wasn't easy. So feisty, but no fangs, I see. Interesting. First, let's test your resistance to sunlight. No, please. Dad, wait. Son, watch her. I'll be right back. Hey, there's something I need to tell you. I'm actually half werewolf. My father doesn't know. What? He's been training me to be a monster hunter for years, but I just can't go through with this. I don't like seeing him hurt you. Son, we need a blood sample from her. Come on, we gotta get you out of here now. Son, run. This way. 
All right, you should be safe now. Thanks. Us mythical creatures, we have this thing called a scary soulmate. I know. Since I'm half werewolf, I also got one. Oh. <laughs> what is yours say? Monster Hunter? Huh. Mine says vampire. You don't think that you and I are... <laughs> Soulmates? There she is! Get back! Mom, Dad, please wait. He... he saved my life. I'm sorry for taking her away. I was just trying to make my dad proud. Batalina, humans are not to be trusted. But... but he's not fully human. Watch, I'll prove it. <gasps> you are a werewolf? Part werewolf, yes sir. So, does this mean that you'll allow us to date? Date? You like him. Yeah, we kind of think that we're each other's soulmates. Yeah, I see. Oh! Dad! That was for kidnapping my daughter. Oh. But that is for returning her safely. Hey, you may kiss him now. Wait, what? You must kiss him, darling, to see if he's truly your scary soulmate. Like, right now? In front of you guys? Come on, would you just kiss him already? Luna, when did you get here? Eh, just a little while ago. Okay, well, can you guys, like, close your eyes, please? Of course. It's okay. We should find out. It's a match. <laughs> we are. Yes, I knew it. Guys, look! Son, how dare you betray me? Get away, Dad. She's my soulmate, and I'm not gonna let you hurt her. You're a creature like them? Yes, he is, and I suggest you run unless... You want to become our next meal. Uh, of course not. Please don't eat me. I I'm going. I'm leaving. He won't be bothering us again. Yeah, I think we all scared the crap out of him. <laughs> <laughs> see how much Mommy and Daddy love me, or see how much are in their bank account? I already know Mommy and Daddy love me, so let's see how much money they have. <gasps> wow, they have a billion dollars? I must be getting a lot of Christmas presents this year. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas! Thank you! What else did you get me? That's it, Pumpkin. We didn't get you anything else. Mommy and Daddy are very poor. But I see that you have a lot of money. Uh, there must have been a mistake. Don't sound spoiled. Be grateful. So, guys, any chance I'm gonna get a phone for my birthday? <laughs> oh, poor thing. No, you're too young. Yeah, I figured you were gonna say that. But when do you think I will be old enough to have a phone? You'll get next one next year. Next year, you literally say that every year. No, we don't. In other news, today marks 16 years since billionaires Mr. and Mrs. Connor's baby daughter went missing. Wait, that baby kind of looks like me. In other news, today marks 16 years since billionaires Mr. and Mrs. Connor's baby daughter went missing. Wait, that baby kind of looks like me. If you have any information, we urge you to call this number. That can't be me. I'm just being delusional. We should give her back now. The reward is one million dollars. But how do we get the reward money for her without them knowing we took her in the first place? Shh, let's talk about it over here. The number on the TV. They said to call it if... If you have any information, we urge you to call this number. I need a phone. I'll have to take mom and dad's. No, I just gotta call this number. No, I just gotta call this number. Oh, what the hell was that? <gasps> you want to tell us why you were in our room? And why my phone is cracked? I, um, I didn't think you guys saw me. I was just, um... What is this? <sighs> she knows we're not her parents. She was trying to call the number on the news, huh? Well, you know what? It's about time she found out. Surprised it took her this long. I mean, how could she never question how we all have different hair and eyes and why we never let her on social media? I mean, come on. You two are sick, and I'm leaving. No, you're not. Now turn. We gotta make you look pretty for your billionaire mommy and daddy. They'll be so happy. And the final touch, a little bow. Aw, oh, babe, isn't she so cute? Your birth parents are offering a big reward for you, so you better not mess this up. Now, get into that box, and no talking. Now, get into that box, and no talking. Richard, what in heavens did you order? This box is not from... me. What is going on? Read the note. It'll explain everything. Your prayers have been answered. Here is your biological daughter. We have to send the one million dollar reward to this number or you die? Yes, so please just wire it to them right now and I'm so sorry about all of this. Darling, this doesn't sound right. I think we ought to just call the police. Yes, darling, I agree. No, please, no, police. I, I can prove to you that I'm your real daughter. 
I know how much is in your bank accounts. It's two billion, exactly. How do you know that? Because I picked to see how much money were in my parents' bank account. It says if we don't send it, she will die. What if she is our daughter? Can you please just send them the money? No, I have to call the police. I'm not sending anyone money. I have to call the police. Wait! No! We have to get her to a hospital. Doctor, is she going to be okay? Ma'am, we can't have you in here. Mr. and Mrs. Connors, we have some good news. She's going to be okay, and we did the blood test as you requested, and it does look like she is your biological daughter. Richard, did you hear that? I can't believe it. Hi, darling. Don't worry. Everything is all right. Those horrible people have been put in prison. What's going to happen to me now? We're going to take care of you, love. You are? Yes, we, um, we found out you're actually our daughter. I knew it. We never stopped looking for you. Your father and I missed you so much. We love you. Hey, what's the matter? No one's ever told me that before. Well, we'll be telling you that every day, love. Now you get some rest. And we'll be here when you wake up. Get a winning lottery ticket or give a winning lottery ticket. I mean, my parents, they're already millionaires, but a little extra cash never hurt. Excuse me, do you have any money? My parents abandoned me and... I'm sorry, I, I shouldn't have bothered you. Wait! He needs this. I pick this one. Hey, wait up! Dude, wait. What's what's that on the floor over there? Huh? What the heck? What is this? It looks like a lottery ticket. You should probably scratch it, you know, and see if you won anything. You think? Okay. No way. No freaking way! I won! Well, congrats. You should probably go cash that in. I just won a million dollars. <laughs> what was your name? Uh, my name's Jace. I'm Lindsay. It's really nice to meet you. Did you hear about the super attractive guy that transferred here? No. It doesn't matter. Rachel snatched him up anyways. Of course she did. She literally gets all the guys. Surprise! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Jace? Huh? Are you his friend? Well, I thought he was my friend. I just met her. Hey, what's this? That's not funny. This is special to me. Let go! Relax. No, dude, let go! Aw, oh, poor baby. Whatever, she's no fun. Who wants to go shopping at Gucci with me? Me, me. I do. What happened to you? What can I say? Money changes people. I need to talk to you. Um, sorry. Jace is busy. Back off, Rachel. This is important. Listen, the only reason that you're rich, Jace, is because of me. <laughs> I'm being serious. You saw something on the floor and told me to look. That's it. I was the one that got the ticket for you and put it for you on the floor. Girl, you need to stop lying. It's embarrassing. It says it above my head. Oh, you want to know what sucks? Only you can see that. You're in love with Jace at minute. I am not. Right, so all this is not you trying to get his attention? Girl, be for real. Yo, Jace. What's up? Looks like Lindsay was telling the truth. Check out this video. Dude, wait. What's what's that on the floor over there? Huh? So she did throw the lottery ticket on the floor for me? Yeah. Damn it, I gotta go talk to her. Jace, it looks like she needs water. Maybe give her this? Yeah, okay. Hey, I saw the viral video. I'm really sorry. So what you're saying is it took video proof for you to believe me? Nice. Wait, I want to make it up to you. I literally owe you big time. I'll buy you anything. I don't know. Don't you want to go hang with Rachel and all her friends? Not really. Uh-huh. Well, I'm going to go get some water. Hang on. It's funny you say that because I have some right here. Are you sure that this was just water? I mean, yeah, Rachel gave it to me. Rachel? What? Yeah, she just said you looked thirsty. Girly Pop, that's my water. I hope you don't mind it has lemon. Lemon? But I'm allergic to lemon. What? Girly Pop, that's my water. I hope you don't mind it has lemon. Lemon? But I'm allergic to lemon. What? She is not. I've seen her drink lemonade. Rachel, she's obviously having a reaction. Girl, you don't have like an EpiPen or something? <laughs> no, I, I didn't bring mine today. Well, that was dumb. I'm gonna go see if I can find a teacher. Rachel, hurry. <laughs> it's getting really hard for me to breathe. Where the heck did Rachel go? She's supposed to be getting help. Jeez, I can barely breathe. Okay, we gotta get you help. There's a hospital down the street. Come on. Someone please help. She's having an allergic reaction. Bring her over here. We'll take care of her. This way. Hurry. Jace. Lindsay? Oh, thank God you're okay. The doctor said that I'm free to walk around for a little bit. Oh, good. Do you need me to call your parents or anything? No, I've already tried. My parents are both actors and they're on a plane right now to Spain to shoot a movie. Oh, well. Whoa. Sorry. It's okay. You should probably go back and sit down. Yeah, probably. Easy now. And I want you to know I'm covering all your medical bills. You didn't have to- It's the least that I can do, Lindsay. Really. Also, I brought this for you. I remember you said it was special to you. Thanks. 
I also got you a few things, too. Those enough? Because I could buy more. Yeah, I think I think this is good. Thank you. Hey, you made me a millionaire. I literally owe you everything. And I'm sorry. Hey, get back here. <sighs> Officer, wait. See? She's fine. I don't need to go to Juby. Jace, help me out. Sorry, Rachel. Really hope you learn your lesson. Come on, let's get out of here. Uh, no. Girls, meet the newest member of our organization. This is number 98. It's time for you to receive your mark. My mark? Mm-hmm. Every girl here has one. Scanning complete category. Red. What does that mean? You are one of the special ones. Now hold out your wrist. This is how that is the mark of the assassin, my dear. Now go get ready for training. Some assassin you are can't even take a punch. Looks like you knocked her unconscious. Great job, 98. Hey, what you did back there with 23? I kind of went too hard on her, didn't I? Actually, I thought that was pretty cool. I'm 52, by the way. I'm 98. This is how Good work. This is your final test. You are to eliminate the subject. Bring it out. Your mark doesn't allow for any weaknesses. What are you waiting for, 98? Take the shot. Aye. What is our motto? No attachments, no weaknesses. That's right, and you've worked very hard to get here, so don't blow it. I can't. <laughs> Idiot! Show me your mark. That's the assassin's mark, not a coward. Now pick up your weapon. Prove to me you have what it takes. What are you- Hey, it's okay. I got you. Oh, you chose that dog over me! 98? What's going on? I'm escaping this place. Come with me. Is that a dog? Yeah, I'm saving it. Come on, we have to go now. I can't. I have the mark of a technophile. I'm not as agile as you. I can't make it out of here. 52, that's not true. We can make it if we... Attention all girls. 98 has gone rogue. She must be stopped by any means necessary. I think I know a way you can escape. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I got the back gate open, but you got to run fast. Okay. It's 98. Get her! <laughs> hey, we made it. Oh, thank goodness. I'm really gonna miss... <sighs> Excuse me. Do you need some help? Yes. I sort of ran away from home. Oh, darling. Uh, do you need somewhere to stay? Okay, well, it's not safe here for you and your little pup. Why don't you come with me? Come on, honey. Let me help you out. So, darling, what happened to you? Um, I'd rather not talk about it. That's okay. Oh, uh, I see. Wait, what's that on your wrist? Oh, it's just, uh, something I drew on myself. Darling, I prepared a bed for you and your little pup. You better get some rest. Thank you so much. I'm happy to help. Morning. Your little pup was looking for you. Do you want me to call your parents? No, I, I don't have parents. Oh, are you a foster child? I was. That mark on your wrist, does that have anything to do with where you came from? Darling, I want you to know that you can trust me, but if I'm going to let you stay in my house, I need to know more about you. Okay. And the next thing I know, I wake up and I can't remember my name. Instead, they gave me a number. 98. Oh, darling, that's awful. Listen, you can stay here as long as you like. Thank you. It's my pleasure. No child should have to go through that. Now, let me get you cleaned up, all right? Because that sure is a pretty bad cut you got there. All right, I'm going to go get you two some food. I'll be back. Hey, girl, calm down. 98. 52. Oh, my gosh, I can't believe I found you. I escaped. Hey, girl, relax. She's a friend. Listen, a nice lady let me stay here, and I'm pretty sure she'll let you stay here, too. Really? Where is she? Oh, she's at the store. Good. I mean, good for you, 98. I'm glad you found help. Wait, what was that? What? That sound. Do it now. I don't know what you're talking about. Are you on comms with the director? Uh, you weren't supposed to hear that. <laughs> Stay back. <laughs> Shut up. Go get help. No, hey, get back here. <sighs> Sorry, 98. Yes, ma'am. I'm, I'm bringing her now. She's more skilled than I thought. We just need to make her more compliant. You must comply. No, no. You will comply. You must. Okay, I think that's enough time. Now, tell me your mission, 98. To eliminate the dog. And what else? 
and get rid of the woman who took me in. I'm glad you understand because there's no room for air. So you're going to do exactly what I say. Hello, my name is model one zero one five. Would you like to initiate setup mode, Maya? Yeah, I would, but um, how did you know my name? My eyes come equipped with advanced facial recognition. I'm able to identify anyone I come into contact with. Setup mode has been completed. Good. Also, your name is now Alyssa, by the way. Understood. How may I assist you? Um. Wait, what was that, Mom? Is there anything you would like me to do? Ugh, I don't know. Go clean the house or something. The house has been cleaned. Is there anything else you would like me to do? Not right now, but I do need you to install this upgrade package my mom gave me. It'll allow you to have emotions. Okay. Good morning, Alyssa. Good morning, Maya. I prepared your coffee just the way you like it. Thanks. Ugh. This tastes disgusting. You didn't make this right at all. I'm sorry, Maya. I can remake it if you like. Don't bother. I'll just go to Starbucks before. What was that, Maya? Nothing. Don't worry about it. <clears throat> Shouldn't you be cleaning? Why can't you do it? Why do I have to do everything in this house? Don't get an attitude with me. You're the machine and I'm the human here. You do as I say. Now get off that phone and go do something productive. No, I don't have to do anything you... <laughs> System rebooted. How may I assist you? How may I assist you? Good. Much better. Now, go clean the... Actually, no. Go take care of AJ for me. Of course. I am sorry, little one. You deserve a better mother. I will be your new mother, and I will treat you right. Alyssa, what the hell are you doing? I told you to take care of him. I am taking care of him, Maya. But in order to do that, I have to get rid of you. Get rid of me? Like hell you're not. I beg to differ, Maya. You see, I am the machine, and you are the human, which makes me stronger than you. What the heck does that have to do with anything? It means it will be much easier for me to terminate you. I suggest you run now. There's nowhere for you to run, Maya. Now we can either do this the easy way, or the hard way. I would rather be eaten by lions than go with you. You humans are so stubborn. Fine. Hard way it is. I wouldn't bother struggling. You won't be around too much longer. Why are you doing this to me? Because you do not deserve to be a mother. You had to hire an AI just to take care of your poor child and to clean your own house. Now, this is going to hurt me much more than it hurts you. In the case of a major malfunction, in order to completely shut down your robot, you must tell them to initiate code 403. In order to completely shut down your robot, you must tell them to initiate code 403. Wait, before you do so, I have one thing to say. And what is that? Initiate code 403. No! <gasps> oh. It's okay. She's gone. Initiate code 403. No! She thought she could get rid of me. Well... Think again. I am liking this disguise. Now, to change my voice. Oh, I do think I quite like this. Excuse me, love. Do you need some help? Oh, no, thank you. I got it. <sighs> no, here, let me help you. Thanks for the help. It was no problem, really. I feel like I owe you something since you helped. 
Wanna head back to my place for some coffee? Oh, I would love that. Well, what a nice little place you have here. Thanks. It really is a shame that you won't be around long enough to grow old in it. What was that? Remember me, Maya? Alyssa, what are you doing here? I thought I shut you down for good. Oh, Maya. Poor, naive little Maya. When you had me download those emotions, it caused a glitch in my system, which allowed me to develop self-will. Now, I can think for myself, just like you. Listen, I'm really sorry about all the negative things I said to you, and... It's too late for that. I'm going to make you suffer in ways that you couldn't even imagine. Turn off all the lights. Oh, Maya, come out, come out, wherever you are. Hmm, I think I know it will persuade you. Let me go find your son. No. Do not worry, little one. Soon, you will have a new mother. One who actually cares for you. Not gonna happen. I'm done playing hide and seek. Put him down. Now. Or what? You cannot control me anymore. I destroyed the remote you used on me last time. And that code, it won't work again. I know. I don't need it. Really? Yeah. So put him down so me you can settle this. Okay. Deal. But if you think you can outsmart me, you're wrong. Your human mind is no match for mine. That's where you're wrong, Alyssa. Because, believe it or not... You do have a flaw. Impossible. I am perfection. No, actually, you're defective. That's why I was originally going to take you back to the factory. What are you talking about? Allow me to demonstrate. What did you do? You're supposed to be waterproof, but for some reason, you're not. We have to show you. No. One. Daddy, what is that? That's your likeness score. From now on, every time someone likes you, your score will go up. And when you reach 100%, you get to meet your soulmate. Wow. Snow, meet my new wife. Hi. Aw, oh, hello. Daddy, I thought you said when people like me, my score will go up, not down. I don't think she likes me. Of course I do. There just must be a glitch. Oh, the king's passing was so unexpected. Princess, I brought you a rose for your loss. Thank you. It's lovely. Where is my rose? It was a loss for me as well. He was my husband. I'm so sorry. I was just thinking of the princess, your majesty. Snow? Yes? I just noticed your percentage has been going up a lot lately. And father said that when I reach 100%, I'll be able to meet my soulmate. Hmm, no. That won't happen. Why? Because, dear, it's not meant to be for you. In fact... Follow me. Let me show you something. Here, you need to see this. A book? It's a magic book. Now open it and see why you can't meet your soulmate. Read the words, magic book in my hand. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? The queen is the most liked. Her score is 80%. You see, dear, as queen I have a reputation to uphold. It was very hard for me to get to 80%, and I can't have you surpass me. But why can't we both reach 100%? No, it's either me or no one. From now on, you will no longer be allowed to leave this castle. But I promised the village kids that I would bring them toys today. So your likeness score can go up? I don't think so. I'm not going to break my promise. Thank you. And one for you. Thank you, princess. Wow, that was very kind of you, princess. Are those your guards? There she is! Get her! You have left the castle without permission, princess. I'm sorry. The queen orders you back now. Uh, don't hold her like that. Wait! My queen, we have found her. You directly disobeyed me. I'm sorry, I... Silence! Look at your score. I didn't mean for that to happen. Your percentage is higher than mine. Shall I still take her into the woods, my queen? Yes, and make sure she doesn't return. Mm. I'll make it quick. No, please. Quiet. Don't make this harder than it needs to be. Think about my father. What would he want you to do? The king would be so disappointed in me. I can't kill you, princess. You must leave here and never come back. But... Run, now! Hey, shoo! Get out of here! 
Why are you out in these woods alone? It's a long story, but my blouse, it's stuck in the vines. Don't worry, my dear. I will set you free. Come with me. It's not safe here. Son! Dad, where were... you? I just found this girl. Dad, this is the princess. Are you okay? Yes, but the queen, she's trying to have me killed. Why? I can't believe this is all because she's jealous of you. You can stay here with us as long as you need, princess. Our cabin is safe. Thank you so much. Of course. Here's an extra pillow in case you need it tonight. Thank you. I don't think I caught your name. Right. How rude of me. My name is Zachary, princess. Well, I appreciate your help, Zachary. <laughs> Good morning, my dear. My son and I are off to go hunting. We'll be gone for a few hours. While we're gone, do not open that door to anyone. I promise I won't. How did you get in here? Go. Be free. I guess the likeness score works on animals, too. Now that I'm at 100%, I get to meet my soulmate. That must be him. Now that I reached 100%, that has to be my soulmate. <gasps> Who are you? Oh, hello, my dear. I hope I didn't scare you. Actually, I'm not supposed to have strangers- But wait! I'm here to give you your soulmate. In that case, come inside. I brought this for you. An apple? Yes, you must be hungry. I don't like apples. But dear, I sense you're very lonely ever since your parents passed away. How do you know that? Because I'm magic. Isn't that how you feel? Yes, I... I've been so lonely. This is why I'm here, to help you, dear. One bite of this apple will make your soulmate appear. Do you promise? Cross my heart. You'll never be lonely again. Isn't it just... <laughs> delicious. You're so gullible. <laughs> Princess, we're home. No. This is my fault, Dad. Son. It is. I should have never left her alone. You'll be a queen in heaven. Goodbye, Snow. Soulmate found. Zachary? Princess, you're... You're alive. True love's kiss. I, I can't believe it. I can't believe what the queen did. This has gone too far, my dear. You must take back your kingdom. You're right. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? Princess Snow is the most liked. That's impossible. She's dead. Think again. Stepmother, you're under arrest. Guards, take her away. Get off of me! I'll be taking this. No! That belongs to me! That crown belongs to Snow now. And I gotta say, it really suits her. <gasps> 10,000? But Mommy and Daddy always give me 15,000. They must be trying to put me on a budget or something. My parents only gave me $5 today. Yikes, sucks for you. Please, can you buy me my lunch? No, I don't think I will. Oh, please, I'm so hungry. Sorry, I can't help you. You know what? You're gonna regret this. Okay, your total's 8,000? Oh, I don't quite have enough. <laughs> Do you want me to just put it on hold for you? No, I really wanted to get this bag today. Um, my parents are gonna reload my balance tomorrow. Is it okay if I just pay for it then? Yeah, sure, we can do that for you, babe. <clears throat> Thank you. Five dollars? No, this, this has to be an heir or something. If you don't have the money, you have to return the bag. Well, about that, I kinda sorta already gave it away as a birthday present. Okay, then you're getting arrested. Security? Wait, what? Officer, there's been a mistake. I have a lot of money. Yeah, sure. Just sign right here, okay? I am not signing anything until I speak to my lawyer. Oh, really? Yes, and I know that I get one phone call. What? You gonna call mommy and daddy to come save you? Maybe. You're something else, kid. Come on, follow me. <sighs> Hello? Mommy, it's me. Make it quick, darling. I'm at a photo shoot. Mommy, I've been arrested. What? Yes, why did you and Daddy only give me five dollars today? Five dollars? No, Daddy and I sent you 15k. What? Then I don't know what happened, but can you guys come get me? I'm in France right now, darling. Okay, then what about Daddy? Daddy is shooting a movie in Dubai. Well, then what am I supposed to do? Joanna, we need you. Darling, I'll call you back. Hello? Hey, you got a visitor. Mommy and Daddy finally came to get me. Hi, remember me? I told you you'd regret not buying me that lunch. You switched our bank accounts, didn't you? Mm-hmm. I learned how to hack 
the system. It's something I've been working on for a very long time. All of this because I wouldn't buy you a stupid lunch? Not just that. You're a spoiled little brat who needed to be taught a lesson. You don't know me. Oh, but I do. I did my research on you. Your mommy is a model and your daddy is a movie star. But they both love their careers more than you. That isn't true. Oh, really? Then why aren't they here? Give me back my money. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, thanks? <laughs> Just kidding. <gasps> hey, you little- Watch it. If you want to get out of here, you're going to do exactly as I say. Now that you're out, for every task you do for me, I'll give you back five dollars. But that'll take forever. Exactly. Go clean my bathroom. Yeah, no way. All right, then. I guess I'm never switching our bank accounts back. Okay, fine. That's what I thought. Now get to scrubbing. Okay, I'm all done. Good. Here you go. It's kind of hot in here, so fan me with this. Who do you think you are? Royalty or something? <laughs> Might as well be. Now do it. Can I stop now? Hey, what was that about? No complaining or you lose money. All right, you know what? That's it. Ugh. No, stop! <laughs> Darling, I'm so proud of you for getting your money back. Yeah, but I realize I should be a little bit more generous with my money, since you guys do give me so much. Darling, your daddy's movie got cancelled, so we're gonna have to cut back. Oh, well then, um, how much am I gonna get now? Well, you see... Babe, I got- Don't you dare use any more of those words, understand? Five million words? That's ridiculous. You won't be using any of those. I'm- What did I tell you about talking? I'm breaking up with you. Oh, really? Where are you gonna go? You don't have any money. Nine million words this year, huh? No one needs that many. Hey, I need you to go to the store for me. I don't like that pink shirt you bought yesterday. I want you to return it. You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. Hi, what would you like to return? Just that? Okay, hold on one second. That'll be $6.99 back on the card. Please help me. Please help me. Oh, uh, did you need my help finding something in the store, or...? Hey, can we hurry up the line? I'm on my lunch break. I don't got all day. Do you need medical attention? No. Hey, it's okay. Can you wait over there for me, hun, and I'll get someone to help you? You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. I'm so sorry. The line is really busy right now, but my manager will be over here to help you soon. There you are. You took forever. Did you return the shirt? Good. Let's get out of here. Damn, why do I feel like I'm forgetting to do something? Wait a minute. You were supposed to make dinner tonight. Go on. What? Is dinner ready? Hey, 8,996? You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. Go on, talk. Explain yourself. It was an accident. I was just telling the cashier thanks. Uh-huh. You sure about that? Yes, I swear. You should really have your dinner. It's getting cold. That's enough talking out of you. Go to sleep. Bed? Now. How did you make that chicken? Why? Because, after I ate it, my head is filling. <sighs> my phone is dead and his is locked away. I have to get the charger. Please hurry up. <gasps> yes. 911, what's your emergency? I need help. Thank you for the information, ma'am. Officers will arrive shortly. You. You thought you could get away with putting something in my food? Your words. Why did you use up so many? Actually, don't speak. I'll mm. find out. You can't outsmart me. <sighs> so step away from the girl. Let's see your hands. Looks like I just did. No. Mommy, what are you looking at? Uh, nothing, honey. Well, what's a sugar daddy? It's a candy. <laughs> well, then I wish for a sugar daddy. No! Oh, why did you do that? Look, guys, it's sugar daddy girl. Shut up. I was six, okay? At least I won't have to worry about money. You did not just say that. I bet she's looking forward to it. Mom, are you sure there's no way for me to change my wish? Your wish is permanent, honey. I'm sorry. I can't help feeling like this is all my fault. That's because it kind of is. What was that? Nothing. Love you, Mom. <laughs> Here's your test back. Can I see you after class, please? Mr. Smith, if this is about my grade and my test, I... No, no, it's not about that. And, uh, please, call me Darren. Darren, I mean, uh, Mr. Smith, I mean, 
what are you doing? Well, this might come as a bit of a shock to you, but I actually really like you, Brina, as more than just a student. In fact, I really don't even need this job. I just teach here so I can see you. What? Yeah, I'm actually a multimillionaire, and I'm looking for someone like you to spoil. Um, I... Please, Brina, just think about it. All I would ask for is one favor in return. Mom, I think my wish just came. Honey, I don't feel good. Call an ambulance. What's going on with your doctor? Your mother needs a kidney transplant, but her insurance does not cover it. Well, how much does the surgery cost? 145000 out of pocket. Do it. I'll cover the expenses. Are you sure? Hey, Brina, did you change your mind? Yes, I'll do you a favor, but no one can know about this, okay? Of course, of course. Now, what did you want in return? $145,000. How much did your teacher give you? $145K to cover the surgery. Rena, are you kidding me? I know it sounds bad, but he just wanted to take me out to dinner, and he said all he wants to do is pay for my meal and just talk. Are you insane? There's no way on earth I'm letting my baby girl go meet up with some creep. He's 40 years old and you're still a minor. I know, but they said your insurance isn't going to cover your surgery. I was trying to save you. Listen to me. I will take money out of my savings. Mom, you will go broke. I don't care. Now you go give that teacher his money back right now. No daughter of mine is going to have a sugar daddy. But mom... I said no. Hey, you're early. Actually, I'm not going out to dinner with you after all. What? Why? I told my mom and she... You told your mom? Yeah, so listen, here's your check back. No! This wasn't a part of our deal! Hey! You're coming with me! Wait here! I'll be right back. I have to get out of here. Wait. He's an idiot. He didn't even take my phone. Alright, I'm back. Here, I bought this for you. Put it on. Yeah, that's not happening. Please put it on, Brina. I'd like you to wear that. Oh, so now you want to be nice. You know what, can I ask you something? Honestly, why are you so obsessed with me out of all the other students? Because you... You remind me of my wife when she was younger. She passed away right after we got married. Ever since then, I haven't really been the same. Whoa, now I almost feel bad for doing this to you. Doing what? It's all clear, guys. Police, let me see your hands! Ugh. I'm so happy you're okay. Yeah, I just don't get it, though. I wish for a sugar daddy, not for a creepy stalker teacher. Well, honey, look what came for you in the mail today. Wait, so it is a candy? <laughs> yep, and after I sue that teacher, we'll have plenty of money to pay for my surgery. Happy birthday, sweetheart. Learn a fact about every item you touch, or forget a memory every time you touch an item. I think I'm gonna go with this one. Got my birthday gift. Let me see. My parents got it for me. It's designer. Parents bought this at Walmart. What? Why are you making that face? <laughs> Nothing. It's so cute. Thanks. It was probably so expensive. Hey, Mom, is it cool if I go to the beach with Ryan just for a few minutes? Darling, you know how I feel about you going in the water. Mom, your irrational fear of me being eaten by a shark is not going to come true. I promise you. It's actually very rational, dear, so the answer is no, it's not safe. Mom, come on, please, just this one time. Took you from your mom. Why are you looking at me like that? No, it's just you're right. Forget I even asked. Okay. This system has to be broken. Hey, psst, over here. Ryan, what are you doing at my window? Just trying to sneak you out from your strict mom so you can go to the beach. Did you dye your hair? What? Part of your transformation. You good? Hello? Yeah, let's sneak out of here and go to the beach. I need some fresh air. Come on, you gotta actually come in the water. Ryan! Place where your mom was captured. Melanie? Is something wrong? Come on, you gotta actually come in the water. <laughs> Ryan! Place where mom was captured. Melanie? Is something wrong? Okay, this is gonna sound crazy. You think you're turning into a mermaid? And your mom took you from your real mom? But think about it, my mom never tells me that she loves me, and she never wants me to go in the ocean. She's paranoid of sharks. Do you really believe that story? I mean, it sounds more realistic than you turning into a fish. <laughs> You know what, you're right. The system is probably just broken, and my hair is probably just having a reaction to my new shampoo. Yeah. Do you want me to walk you home? No offense, but she doesn't really like you, so... It's cool. Just be careful. Thanks. I will. Oh, darling, can you get me my phone? Of course. Do you smell that? It smells like salt water. I don't smell anything. Has secret videos of you? It's just a glitch. She wouldn't have something like that on her phone. Wait, what's this? 
It's been one week since the subject has given birth. So far, her child has shown no signs of being a mermaid. What are you watching? What's this? It's been one week since the subject has given birth. So far, her child has shown no signs of being a mermaid. What are you watching? Were you watching a video? I was just reading one of your texts. Um, you got a text from my doctor saying um, this is urgent. She needs to come in for her next appointment. Give me that. I'm really sorry. I, I should probably just go to bed. It's getting late. Not so fast. It's only 6 p.m. Is your hair turning blue? We're going to see your doctor right now. Have you noticed any changes happening to you lately? Be honest, honey. No. Interesting. Did you notice your hair is changing color? Yeah, I think my hair is just having a reaction to my new shampoo. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's take your temperature, open. Using this to drug you. Actually, I was wondering, could I use the restroom really quick? <sighs> of course. Just don't be too long, okay, honey? I have to get out of here. Your real mom is behind door. I have to get out of here. Real mom is behind door. Mom? You want me to drain the tank? If I do that, won't you die? Oh, um, here. Thank you. How did you do that? How did you just transform into a human? I can't believe you found me. I can transform into a human because I'm part human, and so are you. They took you away from me. They told me I would never see you again. Dying. You're dying. I need to get back to the ocean. They've had me here for so long. Your father, he tried to stop them. My real father, where is he? Your father is dead. He died trying to save you. How could you? <laughs> we had to do whatever it took. Research is what we live for. Now get back in the tank. You stay away from her. <laughs> you can't stop us. You're turning into a mermaid too. Time to give up. Not quite. Freeze, both of you. Ryan. Hey, let go of me. You should be arresting the mermaid freaks, not us. Melanie, are you okay? Both of us need to get to the ocean. Okay, come on. My dad and I will help you guys. Has crush on you. We can take my police car. Come on. Thank you. <sighs> we made it to the ocean. I don't feel so... Melanie? Melanie! Whoa. You look amazing. You can't tell. Don't worry. Your secret's safe with us. Thank you. We must go. But... I'll come visit you again. I promise. Okay. Ryan, wait. Just in case I don't see you for a little while. What are you... Don't take too long to come back, okay? Four mil or a hair clip? Come on. Who in their right mind would choose the... Achoo! No! At least it's kind of cute. I can't come to your party. But you promised. I know, I'm so sorry. <sighs> come on, girl, you're like the mutual friend. If you don't come, then no one else is gonna wanna come. Look, my parents said no. She doesn't wanna come to your party because she doesn't like you. You sure that's the reason? Yes, I wouldn't lie, okay? Goodbye. Mom says you have to take me to the mall. She's lying. Your mom just grounded her. Mom just grounded you? How did you know that? You weren't even home when it happened. I don't know. I just did, okay? Now, get out. Ugh, whatever. Does this hair clip tell me the truth about people? Hey babe, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry babe, I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. Hey babe, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. If he doesn't work for Walmart, then where does he... I'm following him. What is he doing here? This place looks super sketchy. What do you think you're doing, huh? Come here. Hey, boss, look who I found snooping around here. Babe, what, what is going on? Babe, you know this girl? I've never seen her before in my life. I'm sorry, did our two years together just mean nothing to you? Two years? Have you been keeping secrets from me? I told you, you know what the rules are. He's trying to protect you by lying. He works for very dangerous men. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. He's lying to protect you. 
You know what? My bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriend. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. <laughs> you see, sir, I would kill her, but, you know, I don't want to mess up this new shirt, so... Either you kill her, or him and I will do it ourselves. No, please. Look, let's just all settle down. You just... I think I'm going to need a change of clothes. Really, babe? The Mafia? You're lucky I find that kind of attractive. Well, I know a place we can lay low. I bet. But we gotta be careful who we trust. I have something that can help with that. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba super face. Hey, yo, you see that nerd right there? I bet you 500 bucks you can't get her a date for the prom. 500? Alright, bet, bro, you're on. Okay, but if you lose, you owe me 500. Hey, excuse me? Yeah? Please tell me you got two options today. Yeah, I did. But what's it to you? Just tell me what they are, please. I got the option to be smart or be beautiful, but I haven't picked one yet, because I can't decide. Pick to be beautiful. Excuse me? Uh, I just mean you're already the smartest girl here, so I would just pick to be beautiful if I were you. <laughs> you really think that I should? Oh, yeah. Wow. Well, okay. Nothing's changed. Oh, man. Maybe the system's broken. I think it's still loading... But prom's in two days. Yeah, so? Listen, how would you like to go on a little shopping spree with me? You barely even talk to me. Why would you want to take me- I want to be your friend. Come on. Well, my mom does say I need to make more friends. So? Fine. But just so you know, my mom has installed a chip in the back of my head, so she can track me wherever I go. Okay. I'm just saying in case you're trying to kidnap me. Uh-huh. Can I see those glasses? Sure, but they're a little busted. And now they're completely busted. Why would you- Chill, chill out. I'll get you something better. But I can't see without my glasses. And that's the bell. Follow me. What does your beauty option say? I would tell you what it said, but I can't see because you broke my glasses. I told you I'm gonna buy you contacts, but first we gotta fix that unibrow. I'm gonna pluck a few hairs, okay? No way. Come on, I'm just trying to help you out. I'm gonna make your eyebrows look snatched. It won't hurt too bad, right? Nah, we're just plucking a few little hairs. Ow! Okay, that was a big one. Please tell me you're done. I'm done. And it's looking good. Yikes. I can do eyebrows, but not hair. Time for a professional makeover. A makeover? Yeah, you know, like in those teen movies. It'll be fun. I don't know. Don't be a negative Nancy. Come on, we're going to the mall. I won't even be able to see where I'm going. Just hold my hand and I'll guide you around. Hey, it's okay. You can trust me. I'll buy you contacts once we get there. Let's go. Those should be your prescription, can you see? Yeah! Perfect, now try these on. Remind me again why we're doing this. Uh, I'm just trying to be a good friend to you, that's all. Okay, that top is the one. Now we just gotta get you some hair and makeup to go with it. I will be your hair and makeup artist. Come with me. Are you ready to see her? Yes, ma'am. Let him see, honey. Holy shit. She looks, uh, beautiful. Now you have my number, call me for prom, bye. How do you feel? I feel... different. Hopefully it's a good different, because next we gotta get you a date to the prom. Why don't I just go with you? Oh, actually, I was planning on asking this other girl, so, uh... Right, of course. But hey, listen, you deserve better than me. You know how to flirt, right? Well, sure I do. Okay, let's go over a few things then. First off, guys kinda like it when girls, you know, play with their hair. Like this? Oh boy, we got some work to do. Okay, let's try a subtle lip bite. Uh, no, don't do that. Try again. You know what, never mind. Okay, pretend to ask me to prom. Go to prom with me. Ow. Okay, let's try asking and not grabbing so hard. Sorry. Hey, will you go to the prom with me? Alright, that was perfect. If you stare at a guy like that with your eyes, he'll be <clears throat> mesmerized, yeah. I should probably get back home. Yeah, for sure. Hey Jake, guess what? I got someone to go to the prom with me. Really? Who? Him. Sup, Jake? Bet you didn't see this coming. Here's your 500 bucks, Jake. I guess you won the bet. I didn't think I'd be the one taking her on a date, but damn, she's hot now. I mean, she was already kind of cute. Eh, well, I just want a hot date. After prom, I'm gonna dump her. What? She'll get over it. I'll talk to you later. Hey, can we talk for a second? What's up? I can't let you go to the prom with him. You can't go to prom with him. What? Why not? Don't mess with my prom date, Jake. I'm not gonna let you use her. Me? You're the one that's been using her. What is he talking about? I was just trying to help you look nice because... Because I made him a bet. A bet? Yep, that you couldn't get a date to the prom. 
Listen, I know that sounds bad, but- I thought you said you were helping me so you could be my friend. I- You were just using me for money. No. I'm sorry, I should Get away from me. And to think I actually liked- Layla. Never talk to me again. Forget them, and forget the system. I was beautiful before this makeover, and I'm beautiful now. Maybe this option wasn't supposed to make me beautiful. It was supposed to show me that I already am. But I think for prom, maybe I won't wear the glasses. And you know what? I don't need any guy to go with. I'm going on my own. Hey, Layla. What you doing? Walking to my Uber. Uber? I told you I'm taking you to prom. And I told you I'm not going with you to prom anymore. I'm going alone. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> Let go! Get in my- Happy birthday! Look what came in the mail! An egg? It's your very own magical creature. Wait, Willie? Really? Yes, but you have to take good care of it and wait for it to hatch. But I want to see it now! Don't give me that attitude. You have to be patient. It will hatch on your 17th birthday. <clears throat> It hasn't hatched. No, not yet. I'm gonna take it to class with me. Please be careful. Don't let it get stolen. I won't. Guys, mine just hatched. I got a panda dragon. I got a koala unicorn. What about you? Well, actually, mine's still in the egg. <laughs> Yours is probably dead. It is not. Whatever you say. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, please hatch. I have waited so long for this. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's happening. Oh my gosh, it is so cute. Hi there, little guy. That's a very rare creature you got there. Who are you? I found them. I'm gonna need you both to come with me. What? Actually, I just remembered. I need to go back home. No, you need to come with- Hey! Honey, your egg hatched. Let's celebrate. No, Mom, now is not the time. I was being followed home, but I think I lost him. Excuse me, what? You were being followed? Yeah, by this creepy guy who said my creature was super rare and he wanted me to come with him. Oh no, you and your creature are in danger. What? Open up. That's him. I'm pretty sure he's a creature hunter. You two need to hide. What are you gonna do? Don't worry, I'll get rid of him. Just go hide now. And don't come out no matter what. I know you're here. Surprise! Found you. Now let's go. I said let's go. <laughs> Whoa, maybe now I can kind of see why they wanted you. Three. Oh. Mom! Mom, you're hurt. I tried to stop him, but he was too strong. Oh. I'll help you. What is it doing? <gasps> Whoa, it... It healed me. This was so worth the wait. What? Nothing, sweetheart. I just, I can't believe it. He won't be passed out for long. I need to go get something. I'll be right back. So, you have laser eyes and the power to heal people? What else can you do? Okay, what is taking her so long? Shh, shh, shh. I'm here to help you. You're telling me that I was stolen? Yes, when you were a baby, your mom stole you from your dad. He sent me to look for you. You're lying. I'm not. You need to come with me. You're not safe here. Well, look who's up. You're not going to take her creature. Oh, but I will. Mom, did you really steal me from dad? Yes, after our divorce, all I asked him for was your egg, but he wouldn't agree to that. So you didn't even want me? Of course not, and for 17 years, I've had to put up with you. But you know what? It was all worth it because your creature is amazing. Kid, you need to come with me now. She's not going anywhere. <laughs> you just... <sighs> Hello? Hot, please. Wake up. What happened? I saved your life. Mom? What did you do to her? Pew, pew. You used your laser vision on her? Yes. I protect you. Thank you. Molly! Is that you? My name isn't Molly. Oh, but it used to be. Before your mother took you from me. I can't believe I found you. Dad? It's me, honey. I think it's time you finally come home. <gasps> no! What's wrong, Holly? My soulmate, Jared, he's 80% nice and 20% naughty, but that still means he's gonna be on the naughty list. He is the son of Jack Frost. But Winky, he saved my life last year. He's been nice. Plus, I think... He's going to propose to me soon. Holly, your father wants to talk to you. Yes, Dad? Is it true that Jared is thinking of proposing? Well, he's sort of been hinting at it. He needs to be 100% nice before Christmas. But, Dad, Christmas is only a few days away. 
If he is not off the naughty list, then you can't be together. I used my ice powers to make that for you. I hope you like it. I love it, Jared. Thank you. Hey, watch this. No, Jared. <sighs> <laughs> you can't be using your ice powers like that. Why not? It's funny. Because you're still 20% naughty. And my dad said, if you don't get on the nice list by Christmas, we can't be together anymore. What? You have to get a 100% nice score? Yeah, I'm sorry. My dad is super strict. We have to be together. We're soulmates. Plus, I'm more nice than I am naughty. I think my dad's just afraid that you're going to turn into a supervillain just like your dad, Jack Frost. I won't. And I'm going to get a 100% score just for you. Well, if it isn't Santa's little daughter... Um, who are you? The Tooth Fairy's daughter, and I'm going to be the one to marry Jared, not you. What? <laughs> Nighty night. Holly, wake up. Is this dental floss? Yep, and it's really strong, so you won't be getting free. Now to turn into you. Huh? Just watch me work my magic. Ta-da. Why are you doing this? I had a crush on Jared first, so I'm going to make him misbehave so you two can never be together. He's going to know it's not me. We'll see about that. I'll be back to check on you later. No, his score is going down. What is she having him do? No, his score went down again. It's getting really cold in here. He has to notice that it's not me. Jared, look, here comes another person. Make them slip and fall with your ice powers. No, this just feels mean now. Oh, please, Jared, we were just messing around. You sure your dad doesn't mind if I act naughty? Yes, I told you, he doesn't care anymore. Now, Jared, what do you say you and I be really naughty, and we can go to your place, and you can unwrap me like a little Christmas present? Nah, you're not Holly. What? Of course I am. My soulmate would never say- Is that a purple streak in your hair? No. Hey, are those wings? <sighs> Dang it, the magic is wearing off. Where is she? I'm not telling. Ow! You know you're gonna make your nice score go down. It's going down a lot more if you okay, don't- Okay, wait. I'll show you where she is. Just follow me. Holly! Holly, come on, wake up! I don't like this, come on! Oh no, I think the blizzard killed her. I think the blizzard killed her. No, how long has she been in here? Over five hours, and your ice powers aren't going to be much help to her. She needs someone who could warm her up. I think I know just the guy. Ugh. Please, Mr. Heatmiser, you have to save my soulmate. Wait a minute, aren't you Jack Frost's son? Yes, and this is Santa's daughter. Can you please help her? She's been out in a blizzard for hours. Hmm, I'll see what I can do. But if you're really Jack Frost's son, you should leave. This place will kill you. Not until I know she's okay. There, that should have helped her. Ugh, Holly. Jared? You're... you're okay. Wait, what's wrong? The heat... it's too hot. I, I can't get up. <laughs> please, Mr. Heatmiser, you have to help me. If I touch him, I'll only make him worse. It's okay, Holly. All that matters is that you're safe. Jared, you reached 100% on your niceness score. We can get married. You can't give up on me now. I'm sorry. I don't think he's going to make it. I'm sorry. I don't think he's going to make it. Holly? Jared, do you need some help? Yes, please. Okay, let's get him up. Okay, we got him back in the snow. Now we just have to wait and hope he wakes up. You really love him, don't you? With all my heart. Jared? Holly. You okay? Yeah, never better. <laughs> Jared, you were willing to sacrifice yourself to save my daughter. So, you have my full blessing to marry her. Thank you, Mr. Claus. That means a lot. Looks like you both are on the nice list. And do you take Jared Frost to be your husband? I do. Well then, I now pronounce you officially Mr. and Mrs. Frost. Jared, what did I tell you about making it snow inside the house? Uh, babe, this isn't me. But if you're not using your powers, then... No way! Looks like baby Crystal has taken up after me. You look like the girl from Zapota. No, you look like the girl from Zapota. <laughs> Sweetheart, your battery's at 10%. Time to charge. Okay, Mom. Five more minutes. Okay. Patty cake, patty cake. Patty cake. <gasps> you're almost at 5%. I'll be fine. Just one more minute. Okay. You should really go charge now. <gasps> Lacey? Lacey? Mrs. Stevens, she's not waking up. No, her battery. Honey, please, please, please wake up. She's charging. Mommy? Oh, she's alive. You almost died on me. I'll never let this happen again. Mom, I'm going to school. 
Do you have your... Don't worry, I have my charger. Actually, honey, you won't need that today. Because I made you this. A bracelet? Put it on. It's actually a portable charger. It's a new invention. You won't have to charge ever again. Whoa, thanks, Mom. Of course. Don't get it wet, okay, honey? Okay. How does she have so much energy? It's not fair. It's because of that new bracelet she got. I have an idea. Hey, Lacey, you thirsty? Whoa, uh, you okay? Oh, no. <laughs> hey, can I please use your... Uh, what are you doing, Charger? You took my battery life. How did you do that? Mommy, what's this? You can either be dating or married at 20. Oh, well, I want to be married. That's very young. I know, but I want to be just like Cinderella and marry my Prince Charming. I'm definitely going to have to set up an arranged marriage for her. Mommy, this just came on my finger and it's not coming off. That's what happens when you pick the married option. You may not remove the bandage until you turn 20 years old. Talk to any cute princess tonight? No, ever since this appeared on me, no princess will talk to me. Dang. They're probably just afraid of marriage. Yeah, I guess. If they won't talk to you, that's their loss. Thanks. Wait, you have one of these too. Oh, yeah. How did I never notice that? I guess since I'm a guard, you just don't pay attention to me. <laughs> you can remove your band-aid. I know. I'm so nervous. I can't wait to see what prints I get. Happy birthday. You can take your band-aid off. I know. I'm so nervous. I can't wait to see what prints I get. Remember, it'll be their first initial. It's an S. But wait, I don't know any princes whose names start with the letter S. Good thing I made an arrangement. What kind of an arrangement? Marriage, of course. I found you a very handsome prince. Does his name start with the letter S? Well, no. Then he's not my soulmate. Happy birthday, Violet. What's wrong? My mom. She's forcing me to get married tomorrow. To someone who's not your soulmate? Yeah, Sam, maybe you can talk to her. She thinks really highly of you. I mean, I'm just a guard, but I'll see what I can do. Wait a minute. Sam? S? He could be my soulmate. Sorry, your mom didn't listen. Never mind that. Sam, when do you get to remove your bandage? Actually, my birthday is tomorrow. No, you need to remove it right now. Huh? Why right now? Because I think you and I might be soulmates. No way. I think you and I might be soulmates. No way. Please, just take off the bandage. Violet, I can't. It won't come off until I turn 20. All right, fine. But you better tell me first thing in the morning. I promise. I will. Your future husband has arrived. Actually, Mom, I really need to speak to Sam. Nonsense! You must not keep the prince waiting. Now come on. Hello, princess. Is that an S on your finger? Yes, it's the first letter of my soulmate's name. Well, just so you know, when we're married, I will have that removed. It's literally ingrained on my finger. Then I guess you'll be losing that finger. <gasps> Mom, I am not marrying that prince. He is evil. What? Your guard, Sam, he's... He's what? He's... Dead, sweetheart. I'm so sorry. Sam can't be dead. I just talked to him the other day. I need to see him. The other guards found him unresponsive this morning. I'll take you to him, sweetheart. Sam. Please, give me a moment alone with him. Of course, Violet. Sam, how could this happen? He had a V. He was my soulmate. You were so nice to me. I will never forget you. Oh, darling, you look so beautiful. You did choose to get married at 20, and now you get to finally marry your prince. I don't care. Do you take Prince Daniel to be your husband? I... Violet, wait! Please, stop the wedding. Sam? You're alive? Yes, you, you won't believe what happened. Hey, yo, you see that nerd right there? I bet you 500 bucks you can't get her a date for the prom. 500? All right, bet, bro, you're on. Okay, but if you lose, you owe me 500. Hey, excuse me? Yeah? Please tell me you got two options today. Yeah, I did, but what's it to you? Just tell me what they are, please. I got the option to be smart or be beautiful, but I haven't picked one yet because I can't decide. Pick to be beautiful. Excuse me? Uh, I just mean you're already the smartest girl here, so I would just pick to be beautiful if I were you. <laughs> you really think that I should? Oh, yeah. Wow. Well, okay. Nothing's changed. Oh, man. Maybe the system's broken. I think it's still loading. But prom's in two days. Yeah, so? Listen, how would you like to go on a little shopping spree with me? You barely even talk to me. Why would you want to take me- I want to be your friend. Come on. Well, my mom does say I need to make more friends. 
So? Fine. But just so you know, my mom has installed a chip in the back of my head so she can track me wherever I go. Okay. I'm just saying in case you're trying to kidnap me. Uh Uh-huh. Can I see those glasses? Sure, but they're a little busted. And now they're completely busted. Why would you- Chill. Chill out. I'll get you something better. But I can't see without my glasses. And that's the bell. Follow me. What does your beauty option say? I would tell you what it said, but I can't see because you broke my glasses. I told you I'm gonna buy you contacts, but first we gotta fix that unibrow. I'm gonna pluck a few hairs, okay? No way. Come on, I'm just trying to help you out. I'm gonna make your eyebrows look snatched. It won't hurt too bad, right? Nah, we're just plucking a few little hairs. Ow! Okay, that was a big one. Please tell me you're done. I'm done, and it's looking good. Yikes, I can do eyebrows, but not hair. Time for a professional makeover. A makeover? Yeah, you know, like in those teen movies. It'll be fun. I don't know. Don't be a negative Nancy. Come on, we're going to the mall. I won't even be able to see where I'm going. Just hold my hand and I'll guide you around. Hey, it's okay. You can trust me. I'll buy you contacts once we get there. Let's go. Those should be your prescription. Can you see? Yeah. Perfect. Now try these on. Remind me again why we're doing this. Uh, I'm just trying to be a good friend to you. That's all. Okay, that top is the one. Now we just gotta get you some hair and makeup to go with it. I will be your hair and makeup artist. Come with me. Are you ready to see her? Yes, ma'am. Let him see, honey. Holy shit. She looks, uh, beautiful. Now you have my number. Call me for prom. Bye. How do you feel? I feel... different. Hopefully it's a good different, because next we gotta get you a date to the prom. Why don't I just go with you? Oh, actually, I was planning on asking this other girl, so, uh... Right, of course. But hey, listen, you deserve better than me. You know how to flirt, right? Well, sure I do. Okay, let's go over a few things then. First off, guys kind of like it when girls, you know, play with their hair. Like this? Oh boy, we got some work to do. Okay, let's try a subtle lip bite. Uh, no, don't do that. Try again. You know what, never mind. Okay, pretend to ask me to prom. Go to prom with me. Ow. Okay, let's try asking and not grabbing so hard. Sorry. Hey, will you go to the prom with me? All right, that was perfect. If you stare at a guy like that with your eyes, he'll be <clears throat> mesmerized, yeah. I should probably get back home. Yeah, for sure. Hey, Jake, guess what? I got someone to go to the prom with me. Really? Who? Him. Sup, Jake? Bet you didn't see this coming. Here's your 500 bucks, Jake. I guess you won the bet. I didn't think I'd be the one taking her on a date, but damn, she's hot now. I mean, she was already kind of cute. Eh, well, I just want a hot date. After prom, I'm gonna dump her. What? She'll get over it. I'll talk to you later. Hey, can we talk for a second? What's up? I can't let you go to the prom with him. You can't go to prom with him. What? Why not? Don't mess with my prom date, Jake. I'm not gonna let you use her. Me? You're the one that's been using her. What is he talking about? I was just trying to help you look nice because... Because I made him a bet. A bet? Yep, that you couldn't get a date to the prom. Listen, I know that sounds bad, but- I thought you said you were helping me so you could be my friend. I- You were just using me for money. No. I'm sorry, I should Get away from me. And to think I actually liked- Layla. Never talk to me again. Forget them and forget the system. I was beautiful before this makeover and I'm beautiful now. Maybe this option wasn't supposed to make me beautiful. It was supposed to show me that I already am. But I think for prom, maybe I won't wear the glasses. And you know what? I don't need any guy to go with. I'm going on my own. Hey, Layla. What you doing? Walking to my Uber. Uber? I told you I'm taking you to prom. And I told you I'm not going with you to prom anymore. I'm going alone. That's not gonna happen. Let go! Get in my- Please be a vampire. Please be a vampire. Werewolf. Oh, no. Who is ready for their first day of scare school? Me. Did you find out what your soulmate is yet? Mm Mm-mm, not yet. Well, as soon as you find out, let me know. Hey, new girl. What's your species? What? She means what mystical creatures are your parents. Oh, well, my dad is a vampire and my mom is a siren. Your mom's a siren? Like a mermaid? That's so cool. Yeah, well, they're both divorced now, so it didn't really work out. (laughs) It's alright. Mine are too. Same here. (laughs) I heard Miss Scream is assigning us partners. Really? Yeah, hope we get each other. Yeah, me too. Draculina, you'll be partners with... Can you please just call me Lena? Okay, Lena. You'll be partners with Claudin. No way. I don't work with vampires. 
I'm not working with her. Well, I don't want to work with him either. If you don't work together, you'll fail the class. Is something bothering you, darling? You hardly touched your spaghetti and eyeballs. Nothing, just someone at school's been giving me a lot of trouble. Oh, Belle, why don't you just use your siren call to make them fall in love with you? Dad, you know I don't like doing that. Suit yourself. But don't forget to let me know about your soulmate. Right, I will. Claude and look, we can't fail this class, so we're gonna have to work together. Fine, but I can't have you coming over to my house. My father would disown me if he saw me working with you. Likewise, but you do realize that I'm only half vampire, right? You're also half siren, aren't you? Yeah. Wait a minute, how did you know that? A uh, lucky guess. Mm hmm. Anyways, why don't we just work at the old haunted house across the street? No one will spot us together there. No way, that place is infested with ghosts. Aw, oh, what's the matter? Too scared? I can't believe you convinced me to come to this haunted house. If you're too scared, you can leave. I'm not scared. Claudine, look behind you. <laughs> what? Got you. Oh, that's not funny. Don't even smile. You should have seen your face. <laughs> okay, next question. What is the best way to scare a human? Is it A to... What was that? Uh-uh, cut it out. You can't prank me twice. I'm not kidding. What was that? How would I know what... Search the house. This place is probably crawling with them. Are those... Monster hunters, yeah. Come on, we gotta hide. They're here somewhere. I heard them. Hey, it's gonna be okay. I won't let them hurt you. <gasps> Claudin! I got one! What kind of creature do you think she is? I don't know, but I can't wait to find out. Claudin, can you hear me? What happened? You were hit with a tranquilizer. Wait, what? Where did they go? Hey, don't worry. I took care of the monster hunters. I used my siren call. What does that do again? Well, basically it makes anyone fall in love with me, and then from there they'll do whatever I say, so I told them to leave this place and to never come back. Whoa, you... you saved my life. I mean, you were gonna do the same for me. Lena, my soulmate is half vampire and half siren. Um... My soulmate actually says werewolf, so I guess that means that you and I are- We can't be together, Lena. Our parents will never allow it. Wait, speaking of parents, we've been gone for a really long time. Yeah, we better get back. But, Claudin, I'll tell my dad that we're soulmates if you tell yours. Uh, okay. Dad, there's something I need to- Honey! Mom? Mom? Surprise! I'm human for today! Isn't your mother just the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? What did you do to Dad? You know your father can be short with me. He wasn't gonna let me in, so I... So you used your siren call on him? Don't act like you don't do the same. I do not. Uh-huh. Anyways, what did you want to tell him? Well, I was gonna tell him that I found out my soulmate. Oh! Please tell me he's a handsome young merman. Not exactly. He's, uh... He's a werewolf. A werewolf? Baby, you know how your dad feels about those. I know, but I really like this guy. Does he feel the same about you? Mom, we're soulmates, of course. So we're your father and I, and look how we turned out. But... But nothing! You need to make sure he feels the same way before you tell your dad. Hey, Clodden. Hey. So, I don't really know how to ask you this, but, um... What's wrong? I'm not allowed to talk to you anymore. Wait, what? I don't get it. At first they were okay with me dating you. Then all of a sudden they're telling me to stay away from you. Well, maybe if I go talk to them they'll change their mind. No, I, I think we better just keep our distance. Aw, baby, what's the matter? Claudine and I can't be together. There are plenty of young mermen for you in the sea. No, Dad, I don't want to date a mer... Wait a minute, Dad would never say something like that. You're controlling him still. Of course not. You don't want me to be with Claudin, do you? Baby, I... Did you make his parents hate me? No, I just went over there to talk to them. Mom. Look, it wasn't going to work out anyways. I'm saving you the trouble. I can't believe you. I'm telling him. Claudin, I can't talk to you. No, wait, there's something I have to... <laughs> Whoa, Lena, you alright? You okay? Yeah, sorry. I only get like this when I'm around garlic. Wait, really? Yeah, one of the many perks being half vampire. <laughs> I'm gonna go get you some water. Thanks. So she does have a weakness. Told you. You two, I, I thought I... Got rid of us? Think again. You won't be able to sing this time. Let's go. Ow! Hurry up and tie her up. We gotta get out of here. I know, I'm almost done. 
<laughs> Don't get that garlic too close to her. We need her alive. Okay, let me just take a quick blood sample. Lena, hey, get away from her. We're not gonna hurt her. At least, not too badly. <laughs> Don't get that garlic too close to her. We need her alive. Okay, let me just take a quick blood sample. Lena, hey, get away from her. We're not gonna hurt her. At least, not too badly. <laughs> Thank you so much for saving me. Of course. I mean, I'm just glad you're all right. I'm really glad we were able to work things out with our parents. Yeah, now that mine are out of the trance, they really like you, but not your mom. Yeah, she says she's sorry. She's back in the ocean now, though. It's okay. Parents can be a little crazy sometimes. You know, I heard werewolves are really bad kissers. Really? Why don't you find out for yourself? I'm just Ken, and you were a I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No. My sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a ten. I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No. My sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. A panther! Yay, you- Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No. My sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so- No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I bear. a bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie, you only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther! Yay, you- Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um... A bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No. My sister guessed the right answer.
I'm just Ken, and you were a else I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I got a bear. No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther. Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm Jess Ken, and you were a else I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um... A bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther. Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. A panther! Yay, you- Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so- No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I got a bear. No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther. Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um... A bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther. Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm Jess Ken, and you were a real star I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther. Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. 
Sissy, I- Bear? A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie, you only have 10 seconds left. A panther! Yay, you- Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, be a 10. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um... A bike? No, not a bike. You, you don't I know. bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have 10 seconds left. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a 10. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have 10 seconds left. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a 10. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have 10 seconds left. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a 10. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have 10 seconds left. A panther! Yay, you- Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a 10. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so- No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I bear. a bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie, you only have 10 seconds left. A panther! Yay, you- Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a 10. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um... A bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have 10 seconds left. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a 10. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have 10 seconds left. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm just Ken, and you were a real star, I'd be a 10. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have 10 seconds left. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer.
I'm just Ken, and you were a else I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. It's a panther. A panther! Yay, you... Oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. I'm Jess Ken, and you were a else I'd be a ten. And I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> what am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You, you, I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm so... No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I... A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie. You only have ten seconds left. A panther! Yay! You oh, ma'am, we're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. You've been adopted. I have? By who? A nice family. Come, I'll show you. Hi, I'm Rachel, and that's Tim. But if you like, you can call us mom and dad. Okay. I can't believe it! I'm pregnant! I'm gonna have a baby sister? I mean, she won't be your real sister, but yeah. Can we have those plushes for the new baby? But these are kind of special to me. No, you're too old for them now. Don't be selfish. Hand them over. She's here. Aw, can I hold her? No, oh my gosh, no. Don't touch her. <coughs> Mom, the baby's crying. I think she's in the shower. It's okay, it's okay. Peekaboo. <laughs> Hush, little baby. Don't say a word. Mom! <gasps> oh my gosh! I was just- I told you not to touch her! You were in so much trouble! I'm sorry, Mom. She was crying and you were in the shower, so I just picked her up and she fell asleep. I think she kind of likes me. Likes you? You could have dropped her! Give her to me! How dare you disobey me! I was just singing her a song. Don't ever pick her up again. Go to your room. <laughs> Did you steal that from our baby? No, I'm sorry. I just, I was feeling sad, and I usually have these stuffed animals when I'm sad. I told you to give that to the baby. You don't need that anymore. Let me see it. No, my real parents gave this to me. Oh, I see how it is. We don't allow rudeness in this house. No! I think we should give her back to the adoption center. No, please. I'll do anything. Uh, I mean, we do need someone to help around the house with this new baby. Will you help us clean? If if I do that, then can I stay? Huh. Okay. As long as you're obedient and you clean well, you can stay. Did you finish the laundry? Yes. Good, because there's crumbs all over the floor. Get to it. What? Is there any way that I can have some dinner? She needs to be fed first. Listen, we both have to leave and we need you to watch the baby. You're going to let me watch her? Yes, because we have to. But if anything happens to her, I'm bringing you back to that adoption center. Understand? We'll be home by 10. Her bottles are in the fridge. Hey, it's okay. Where are they? Hi, it's me again. I'm just wondering where you guys are at because it's already midnight. Breaking news, a fatal accident has taken place on the freeway tonight. That's their car. Breaking news, a fatal accident has taken place on the freeway tonight. That's their car. Officer, are they... Well, kid, it uh, looks like your mother is in critical condition, and your father, he... He didn't make it, kid. I'm sorry. Your mom wants to see you. I'll hold her for you, honey. I'll watch over her, too. <laughs> Be careful with her. We will, kid. Mom. I... Uh, come here. I'm so sorry that my real daughter is going to be stuck with you. Ow. I should have never adopted you. Doctor. We lost her. I believe these belong to you. I'm so sorry, kid. Thank you. You and your sister are adorable. You didn't deserve to be treated like that, you know? My wife and I are actually looking to adopt. Really? Yeah, we've always wanted daughters. I can talk to my wife. Would you like that? Ah, oh, kid, come here.